Nice to meet you online. My name is Ji Hun Choi and I'm a PhD candidate of Postec. First, I'm very grateful to present my work at AFM 2021. The topic I'm going to present is laser induced gravitation on natural wood for desorting solar evaporation. More than 70% of the, the Earth's surface is covered by water but the problem of global water shortages continues to increase. This contradiction comes from the fact that 97.5% of the Earth's water is saline water, like brine or seawater, and only 2.5% is the fresh water. As a result, there is an increasing demand on technologies that can desalinate seawater into fresh water that humans can drink. Various techniques, including reverse osmosis and multi-stage flash, have been developed, but they require huge energy. Solar steam generation (SSG) is a technology to produce desalinated steam from saline water using abundant solar energy, especially. Interfacial SSG, ISSG localizes heat on solid air water interface so that it performs more efficient evaporation. For highly efficient ISSG, following properties are needed. High light absorbance and thermal insulation for energy efficiency, and faster water transport and large surface area for faster evaporation. And there is one more essential factor, and it is salt resistance. Conventional SSG is easily blocked its top surface by precipitated salt so that the, the energy conversion efficiency is reduced. First, treat G for salt resistant SSG is donut potential. Charged layer generates donut potential and rejects ions electrochemically. However, it demands nanopores and less durable. Second one is redissolution of salt. Vertical microchannel or hydrophilic layer lowers the concentration of salt by effective water transport, so it is permanent strategy. CO2 laser techniques are widely used for cutting or converting substrate materials. With the razor, substrates can be photothermally converted into grafting materials or just ablated. These techniques enable one-step process for patterning, graftization, and ablation. In this work, CO2 razor was used to fabricate light-absorbing layer and grid grooves on wood. Grid groups are expected to act as redissolution sites of salt for the salt resistance of SSG. Bassoot was first irradiated by short razor all over the top surface with lower power to fabricate right absorbing layer by surface gravitation. Then grid groups were fabricated with higher razor power. The morphology of LIG wood was studied with SEM. A few 200 micrometer sized vertical microchannels are retained even after repeated laser irradiation. The microchannels can facilitate the water transport. LIG F wood has a smooth surface like bass wood, and LIG G wood has grooves in a square grid. Raman spectroscopy and EDS show the chemical changes after laser irradiation. While only a broad background was observed for basswood, the characteristic D and G bands were observed for LHG wood. Also, the oxygen to carbon ratio was decreased. These results indicated that Graphic carbon was formed after laser irradiation. With the graphic carbon layer, 
right absorbance was greatly increased from 50% to 98% after the laser irradiation, which indicated that LHG wood can act as a good solar absorber. During solar evaporation, the surface temperature of LHG wood increased to 42 degrees Celsius after one hour, while that of basswood and water increased just 35 degrees Celsius and 30 degrees Celsius, respectively. With LHG wood, solar energy could be absorbed effectively and then conducted to interfacial water to be evaporated. As a result, evaporation rate and energy conversion efficiency enhanced in the presence of LHG wood. Evaporation rate enhanced 2.4 times and energy conversion efficiency enhanced 4 times comparing to water only condition. The high evaporation performance was achieved by high light absorbance of gravity carbon layer, faster water transport through meniscus and micro channels, and heat insulation of wood. This result is higher than or comparable with other wood based SSGs researched before. Also, as we expected, LHG wood performed salt resistance. Salt was accumulated on LHG app just after 2 hours of evaporation in 20% salt water, but wasn't on LHG wood even after 12 hours. Also, LHG wood maintained evaporation rate and salt resistance in 20% salt water during 2 weeks. Salt resistance was achieved by forming meniscus. Owing to the stubble density of wood and hydrophilicity of gravity carbon layer, meniscus was formed on SSG surface and lowered the salt con concentration by facile water transport. We could also develop salt resistant SSG with plastic by using same method. Black acrylic block with corrugated structure performed almost the same evaporation performance and salt resistance with LHG wood, which indicates the advantage of the corrugated structure. In summary, we developed wood-based SSG with high evaporation performance and salt resistance using one-step laser process. This result is promising for practical use in seawater desalination using solar energy. Thank you for your attention. Following slides are appendix and please leave a message if you have any question. Thank you.